instant biology by dr nila in today's video we are going to talk about the internship and research immersion in singapore the iris program at national university of singapore so uh, before starting the video i would like to request everyone please to subscribe to our channel and you know uh, share our video so that we can make more such videos and share with most of more students so let's dive into the video if you search in search on google internship and research immersion in singapore at nus the first link that appears is cde.nus.edu.sg you click on to that you get redirected to this home page this is internship and research immersion in singapore iris at nus so the program is basically a fully funded fully funded two month program which uh, welcomes undergraduate and master students from all over the world what it offers is a uh, mentoring and also you know gives a con- opportunity to contribute to ongoing projects work in world class facilities and gain hands on experience in cutting edge research let's look at the program features so the two months of intensive research experience with exposure to state of the art research and facilities at nus you get close mentorship and guidance from nus faculty members throughout the internship you also get project presentations interactive workshops and hands on practice a certificate of completion is issued by the nus graduate school at the end of the program you get sgd 1200 stipend per month also sgd 600 travel allowance you get you get co- also get complimentary on campus accommodation so this is basically a fully funded program also you ne- get to explore singapore and the nus campus and experience what it's like to live and study here in the future the program schedule is the uh, duration of your program will be june to july 2025 application deadline is 28th february 2025 please keep that in mind the first round results are released on mid march 2025 the shortlisted candidates get to be interviewed by the assigned faculty members then the final list announcement happens on end of march 2025 what is the selection criteria your academic ex- excellence passion and diversity is seen here So the eligibility criteria is having a minimum overall or major GPA of three point five on a four scale. You get to be enrolled full time in a degree granting program, having completed at least the first two years of the UG degree program or being in the first year as master student. That just means that you need to be in your third year if you are in UG, or you need to be on your final year of masters. At least you need to be completed of your first year if you are in masters pro student. your application material includes includes an academic transcript a detailed cv with no more than 2 a4 pages a personal statement that outlines your previous academic and research experience with a focus on your research interest it is acceptable if you do not have prior research experience you need to have two letters of recommendation uh, it is highly recommended that uh, the recommendations come from faculty members and supervisors who can specifically attest to your academic potential and research preparation for the program now we'll get to know how to apply in a while let's just look at the faculty members who would be pro- providing you for with this program it there are programs of different research domains you need to select your research area of interest and you know you need to put that in under the research section when the application portal you will be filling your application portal at the minimum please specify the school and department at nus where you wish to be placed for your research internship there is a list of preferred mentors so please do fill it uh, you need, you get to select a potential faculty member or specific research area through this link you need to click on this nus thesis advisors page once you click this all the uh, faculty members who are providing will appear just like this uh, you know you have psychology english linguistics and theater architecture we will look at life science and life science allied research domains here is biochemistry if you click on view profile you get to view the profile of uh, this professor and you know at with uh, which research domains they are actually working on the research interest are cancer biology cancer metabolism and their publications are also given here so by looking at any of them you can you know view their profiles and you know you get to know about the research domains and uh, you can specify their names and their research domains when uh, you are uh, filling your application form so this is how it works you know there are biomedical engineering and also there are more you can go on to more pages and uh, look for 
your spe uh, research specific research area of interest so once you do it then you need to fill your application you click on this apply here you do not have a gd83 account you are a new register so you new user so you go to register then this appears you fill your email address first name last name you give your birth date and then you continue before uh, i say anything else i would like to uh, specify something important so as you know our company samadhan life sciences offers a unique program we call it the uran program what we do basically is we provide services you know general consultation and advisors on international university applications so if you are someone who is thinking of applying to nus or any other university abroad you you need and you are you know uh, need any advice on how to choose your uh, specific interest uh, spe specific university which would be of your interest and you know consultation document preparation etc so our program helps you with all of that we take care of it first we give you advice on international university applications how to get your uh, cv shortlisted um, how to get your application shortlisted among all the thousands on uh, thousands and lakhs of application forms which get submitted every day then you know document preparation we help you with sop writing letter of motivation cv preparation sop is some uh, something which is very important and very thoroughly scrutinized when you are applying for an international university we also connect with connect you with mentors who help you with interview preparation we give mock interviews and you know we we take mock interviews and give you tips for success so how this works exactly is we you, know, you schedule an initial session with us our initial consultation fee is rupees 299 for 45 minutes we connect you with experts you get matched with the specialist a specialist who is of your uh, specified research area of interest then you make a uh, we make you a customized plan you receive tailored support from us and then we help you in achieving your goals through navigating your application process with confidence if you are someone who is interested please do contact us at 82991345288 or you can email us at samadhanlifesciences@gmail.com so let us dive into the video so as i was saying if you are someone who is interested in applying please do apply before 28th february in this uh, through this portal apart from this let us see if there is something else i need to tell you there is an application guide if you are uh, looking for how to apply this is how you apply on the applicant portal you click on the add new program once you get registered you select the program the degree type you will select is non degree program and you will uh, select full time your enrollment will be june 2025 special term then here comes the program here you what degree would you like to apply for this is done you click on apply now button here and then you give your personal informations like name biographical information nationality information contact information next of kin information language proficiency etc you give your academic qualifications ug pg then there are referee you need to have minimum of two referee reports which would be given by your supervisors or uh, faculty members who have taught you then you need to have supporting documents personal cv personal statement is mandatory then you need to have declarations the first declarations is are you currently or have you been under investigation charged with a subject to disciplinary action these are some different declarations you need to accept them and you know answer yes or no then the review before submission ensure that all the referees and compulsory information that which are in red font are provided before submission then you click on submit once you click on the submit application the application is submitted and you know you can see your status of your uh, uh, application here please note your application id sometimes is re uh, required once you get shortlisted for interview so this was all about today's video if you are someone who is interested in applying abroad please do uh, apply to this program this is a very uh, prestigious university national university of singapore and and moreover it is fully funded 
so it would be a great opportunity for you so today's video was all about this if you have any query please do let us know in the comment section if we know if we would uh, always reply and if you liked our video please do like our video and subscribe to our channel and share our video so that we you know you can we can keep on making more such videos online and uh, thank you very much